Uh, you can probably only hear my AC. Hey, fuckers. What's up? I know you guys are like, what's that? And I'm like, I don't know what that is, to be honest. But, oh my god, it's so hot up. I just got back from the gym. I'm in the gym parking lot, but... Oh my gosh. So warm. My thighs are fucking killing me so bad. Like, so bad. I don't know if it's ever... Hit a new PR! I don't know, if, know what the fuck PR means. Surprisingly, my drink is still icy. I was really sad. I was like, I'm gonna just pay for this whole drink and just had it made with love. And My pumpkin spice latte. Oh, holy guacamole. I drove around so much today. Like, my mom was in Burger King and she's on like the opposite side of town. So I had to go to Burger King, go there. And I was like, okay, like, my girl wants me at Starbucks, so I went back all the way over there, I got gas, and I went back, and I went to the gym, and holy guac, there was just so much driving, but when I was going to Burger King, there was like, like someone on the side of the road that was like, had a sign that said, need money for gas, and you know, like, I get it, like, I saw them before, and I was like, oh, I get it, you know, like, you just don't have enough money, but I saw them again, a second time. I'm like, have you guys just been out here this whole time? Like, still no one's giving you money for gas? Or or we just come here every day? And I was like, hmm. Because conveniently, they're fucking right by the Burger King that's hiring. And I feel like... I don't know. I just had such a fucking... Unliberal thought about it. And I was like, they're fucking hiring everywhere around you. If you need gas money that often, like... I don't know. Sitting in the sun, holding a sign. And then fucking like following my car as I'm fucking, I'm like scared. I'm like making fucking eye contact and locking my fucking doors. Like rolling my windows up. I don't know, I'm like, I'm like, get a job. I don't have a fucking job, so I can't really talk. But I'm in college, so that's totally different. I could get a job if I wanted to, but I don't want to. My parents aren't making me. I like to say I have a good worth at work ethic, but I think it just proves I'm not. But I feel like a fucking lazy fucker. But I'm literally on my own summer break. And, like, I don't need the money. Like, I've got money. So, I'm like, I don't need to work because I've already worked to get the money I have, so, like, I don't know, if I don't need the money, like, why I work, which is, like, oh my god, stupid, but, like, yeah, I think it's stupid, too, but my parents don't want me to stress out, so, like, we'll fund your lifestyle, aka pay for my gas, and my insurance, and everything ever, but, this came out of my own bill, so that's how you know I'm struggling. PayPal but no is linked in the Instagram bio if you want to support me. Just kidding. <laughs> they are, but. But I'm like, why not just literally, like. I feel like there's so many other things you could do besides fucking. Here's a sign. Like, fucking work. I don't know. Like, do you see everyone else fucking out their little job? I bet you fucking went into a store, bought something. Tore out the cardboard from that something, which you bought from a store, which had a fucking employee fucking beep. Okay, have a good day. Blah, blah, blah. And then you just, you're like, okay. And you're like, gas money, please. And you just fucking show it. Like, imagine being that cashier and being like, I literally sold you that fucking cereal box. Like, <laughs> you had a platinum credit card on your... I just don't know how much they make. Because I've seen so many, like, little videos that it's like, Oh my god, they're scams. They're so scams. Like, I'm sure fucking... How is it not a scam? Like... Like, I feel like you're getting scammed either way. 
no matter if it's like for a good cause or not because you're just giving your money to someone you know like you're not getting any benefit out of it except like your own like i help someone okay like either way you're gonna fucking help someone like even if they're like oh i'm gonna use their money for a crack you're helping them with your money so you know it's like i need to feed my family or i need gas for my car like you're you're like oh I'll help you're just fucking helping them either way so maybe you're not being a scam maybe that's the whole thing i went to a town where it's like literally illegal for people to accept things from like vehicles and like the month before when i went there i didn't even know it like fucking passed so there's like so many people everywhere like everywhere you stop there was like someone asking for money and then the month like next month i went there there's no one and there's signs everywhere that was like, it's illegal. So I'm like, what the heck? Oh god, my boy's almost gonna come with my car. Like, are you recording me? Fuck you. Do I look I'm like, hey. Yeah, bitch, I'm recording you in my own car. Like you've no expectation of fucking privacy out in fucking public, especially my fucking car. You know, I feel like I have my own fucking right to film whoever the fuck I want in my own car. You know, I feel like such a fucking... Rawr. Homeless people need to get a fucking job. Homeless people get a fucking job, man. Just get a fucking job, man. They're hiring. Get a fucking job. Get off them damn streets and get a fucking job. Let me turn this. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light? We're so proud. I'm trying. Have you? I feel like I'm the only one ever who's seen the fucking Fergie video. So I feel crazy. I feel like I just made it up. <sighs> if you're homeless, get a job. If you're if you're in public, expect to be recorded. If I'm out in public, I will be recording you. Thanks. <sighs> Fucking privileged white girl. That's me. Yeah, I'm drinking a pumpkin spice latte and my parents pay for my gas and I'm complaining about homeless people not working when I don't work. <sighs> Is it illegal to have an opinion now? That's what I'd say. Go ahead and comment, you know? I love getting comments. They're so funny. Like, I have people that hype me up, and I love them. They're so nice to me. And then, like, the fucking random, you scare me. Yay! Like, I don't want to be comforting. Like, you shouldn't feel comfortable watching my videos. You should feel never at ease watching these bad boys. See, there's a jump scare. I'm trying to think of a sip to them. No makeup, bare face. <laughs> Natural beauty check. I have eyebrows on, so. I'm lying. My hair's so greasy. I want to shower when I get home. But I just thought I'd a little vlog. I just watched a guy pour out a Mountain Dew out of a can out his window. My armpit. Um, my fucking update on my ingrown pube. It's like just a little red dot now. I'm gonna tell my boyfriend I'm waiting for a fucking marriage. Cause I'm so insecure about it. I hope he never ever sees it. It's not even like a fucking like a little like it's not even a bump. It's just a little red dot. Maybe I'll have him extract it out. Because I know when I tried to do it, it turned into a scab. And then that got weird. But now, I just need to cut it open. He wants to be a doctor, bitch. Fucking fix my fucking ingrown pubic hair. There's just one little red dot. Maybe that will be his favorite thing about me. And he'll write in all of his love letters to me. I love you not only for your amazing good looks, your beautiful 
pink, gorgeous pussy. I was gonna say brain bag, that'd be funny to say that. <laughs> brain and your super awesome opinions in your YouTube channel. I love your YouTube channel, babe. You're just so, God, you're just so amazing. You know, the way you formulate the words that you speak onto your camera, which you post on the internet. God, I just love that about you. I'm like, uh, yeah, it's so funny. I, I just, it's just a passion project, you know? I just, I'm just really passionate about it, you know? Like, y'all, babe, let me support you in your YouTube career. Oh, you got YouTube con, YouTube convention, because your fans want to meet you? Yeah, babe, we can go to Malibu after. I'm like, okay. You know. He bought me Chick-fil-A yesterday, so I think we're going to get married. I think we have to.